What's up, you guys? Happy Monday. So I am here with an update on The Real Housewives of Potomac. They are filming for the next season, which is scheduled to air in the fall. And if you didn't know, there is a new housewife being added to the crew. She is another Nigerian. So shout out to all my Nigerian girls out there. Now we have two Nigerian women on the show. Both Wendy and the new woman, I believe you would pronounce her name Nika, N-N-E-K-A, Nika. Nika and Wendy are getting into it. Surprisingly, they're getting into it according to TV Deets. At TV Deets has all of the reality TV tea. So make sure you follow them at TV Deets, D-E-E-T-S. And they posted a literal fire, newbie Nika versus Wendy. Ah! And the husband's in the mix too. Karen's pickleball event truly had it all. So there are pictures floating around from an event that Karen did, which was a pickleball event, which the husbands attended. Even Juan, even Juan attended the pickleball event. You know, he's got plenty of free time now that he's not working. So he attended the event. Nika's husband attended the event. Wendy's husband attended the event. Of course, Karen's husband attended the event. All the husbands of the show allegedly attended the event and it was a problem. It was a problem between Wendy and Nika. And so I want to get into it because Wendy and Nika have so much in common that I think this might be why they have conflict. So let me just give you a little background on Nika. TV Deets reports that she's a licensed attorney specializing in financial technology and she's the owner of her own champagne line. She's a graduate of both the University of Michigan and the University of Wisconsin Law School. And her father is a very well-known cardiologist. I can't pronounce her father's last name, but his first name is Leo. His last name starts with E. And if you look up Nika by her mating name, the same name as her father, you'll see where she went viral from a huge gift that her father gave her. So she also, speaking of what she has in common with Wendy, she also briefly worked as a correspondent for CNN. She was a political commentator, just like Wendy. So they have that in common. She also lives in Potomac, in the Potomac area. So she has that in common with Wendy and she's married to a professional. Her husband is a medical doctor. Wendy's husband we know is an attorney, but her husband is, an, is a doctor. She is an attorney. And if you read Wendy's book, you know that Wendy wanted to be an attorney, but she actually failed out of law school. <laughs> she failed out of law school and she blames Barack Obama. It's a whole story to it. So there might be a point of contention there being that Nika did go through and become a lawyer and Wendy didn't. And then also Nika's husband is an investor in a lounge. Like you guys remember when Wendy wanted to open up a Nigerian lounge? Nika's husband is already doing that. He is an investor in a lounge. I don't know the theme of the lounge, but I do know he's an investor in a lounge. So I don't want to say there might be jealousy there, but there's definitely something going on there, according to TV Deeds, who has the tea on the filming of this coming season of The Real Housewives of Potomac. You guys, leave a comment. Let me know what you think about the woman allegedly not getting along with Wendy, which possibly means that she's hooked up with the Green Eye Bandits. And how do you think Wendy is going to react to her, being that she has the things that Wendy wanted at one point in life? Like she has the law degree, her husband has the investment in the lounge, and she has her own product with the champagne line. Leave a comment and let me know what you think about all that, you guys. As always, thanks for watching. <laughs>